Slender Man to be his friend. Slender Man ran away. Oh, well, what was that? So guys, we're here at the Harvest Church in Port Allen, LA, and we're here for our monthly youth meeting. The first Sunday of every month we have one of these meetings, and I encourage you all to come out and hear a word from God. It's really great. Awesome time of praise and worship, an awesome meeting, great snacks and food and fellowship and all that. So yeah, just come out to that. Watch the rest of this video. We do this every the first Sunday of every month, and it goes from Centaur's Church and the Harvest Church right here. Then we go to the Rock Church, then we go to our church, which is New Life Worship Center. So I encourage you guys to come out for some awesome place of worship, some good food, fellowship, and a great message. See you guys. Distraction. I bind you, Satan, that would want to come in this place and cast fear on the hearts of the people here tonight. God, I, I just speak freedom tonight, God. Freedom tonight, Jesus. Holy Spirit, come in and set our hearts free. Set our hearts free, Holy Spirit. God, let us be free to worship you. I bind all spirit of fear in Jesus' name. We'll take the city. We'll be prosperous in Jesus' name. We're gonna start with a little bit of a feel good song, y'all ready? Jesus, let me see your eyes. Let me feel your embrace. Let me feel you all around me. Yeah, yeah. Jesus, let me see your eyes. Let me feel your embrace. Let me feel you all around me. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. 
feel your embrace. Let me feel you all around me.
every Sunday every we person. have probably four different youth groups that come together and it's a great time for a lot of kids from different youth groups to try to get to know each other and hang out and just be cool. So um, and we have praise and worship. It's a lot of fun. The kids go crazy. I go crazy. We all just go nuts. And um, and then we have maybe a word. We have healing times. We have ministry times, prophecy times. It's whatever the Holy Spirit wants to do. We give him rain to do. And it's different every night. And it's always awesome. You know, I think in the youth that come, it has, because there are kids that come in here and they'll get ministered to, and then they'll talk to me throughout the month or the week, and they tell me how God is using this, these meetings and the people they're meeting here to pour into their lives, and how much these meetings uh, encourage them to go out into their week and live for God. And I really do think a lot of kids get ministered to, a lot of adults get ministered to, a lot of people, anyone who comes here, they just love everything that happens here um, if you're not too scared to just have a free Holy Spirit service and get you know free and have fun then this is a really good place for you and so I, I, I recommend it that you come whoever come because uh, we have a lot of fun um, if I could say one thing about this service specific is that it, it really is a place where the Holy Spirit can have his way. Now, I mean, we're all weak vessels. You know, I'm not saying we have just the most awesome, powerful, dynamic, sea-splitting services you've ever seen. But we do allow the Holy Spirit to move. And we're not as much refined by time constraints as a typical church service is. Um, I understand a church service needing those, and that's fine. But these meetings are once a month things that we do, and we come together, and we'll sometimes we'll go for an hour and a half, two hours, since just straight worship, prophecy, word. Sometimes we'll have a word at the end um, after about an hour of, or 45 minutes of worship. And it's different every week. It is always encouraging. It's it's very just free for the Holy Spirit to do what He wants to do. And you don't find that very often um, in services today. And so I, I want to say that it is a, it is the freest service I've been a part of on a regular basis probably ever in my whole life or just in many years. And so um, I get a lot out of it. I know everyone else does. We all enjoy it. And... Um, I encourage anybody to come if they're wanting just to kind of get submerged in a deeper dose of, uh, of God's presence. What's up? Good morning. Are you recording? <laughs> How you doing? It's Stephen Babin Project. Oh, you're videoing? Yo, hey, yo, this is where I live, bro. <laughs> hey, come on in. Come on in. Yo, listen. Oh, it's my bad, my bad. No, Anyway, anyway. Let's walk somewhere because we. Oh, they got the nurse down there. I love you all. Ha! See, this is a water fountain. I usually drink from it. Mmm, scrumptious. That little girl, she's a. That's a bad little girl. Anyway. So what are we doing? What are we doing with this camera? It's your house. Tell us. Oh, anyway. It's your house, man. It's not my house. It's God's house. God's house. It's God's house. Yeah. Yeah. Get that right.